Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a from head to toe step-by-step -step tutorial on basically how to need a link. First things first, makeup. I am first applying a light eyeshadow as my base. Using a combination of these two eyeshadows, I am reshaping my eyebrows. I am using a brown eyeshadow and placing it on my entire lid and crease. At some point, I even took some black eyeshadow to define the outer corner and crease. Go on your lower lash line too. Grab your favorite eyeliner and go all around your eye. Make sure to fill in your waterline as well. Apply mascara on top and bottom lashes and then apply some falsies. Lastly, take a shimmery eyeshadow and apply it on your brow bone. Warm up your entire face with some bronzer. Apply a coral blusher. Now for the lips, take a dark nude almost brown lip liner and line your lips. I decided to go a little over my lips to make them look fuller. Then using a similar but lighter liquid lipstick fill in the lips. Go to the edges of your lips with the same pencil. Lastly grab the shimmery eyeshadow again and highlight the highest points of your face. Time for the hair! You will need a small and a big brush, two elastic bands, a red robe, hair extensions, bobby pins and hairspray. Start off by sectioning your hair. You need two pieces in the front for the bangs. And then you just basically put the rest of your hair in the highest possible ponytail. Use some hairspray to keep your hair in place. Put on your extensions around your ponytail and make sure to comb them all together. Then use the other elastic band to secure everything. Take a bobby pin and pin it through the rope. Then tie it all around your ponytail. This will hide the extensions. Do not hesitate to use a lot of bobby pins. Straighten your bangs and apply hairspray on them too. Costume time! Now I know this is gonna go really fast, so if you have any questions, just ask. I am also showing you the piece that I will wear under it, because this is an issue too.
props are part of the costume too. I really, really love making them, except for the papier mache part. I really hated it. I am so proud of my spear. It was actually my first time making something like it. Whoop, different background. I am using a white body paint to create the patterns Nidalee has on her face and body. I did not paint my thighs because I need help for that. I can't reach it on my own. Take an emerald, not a real one obviously, and glue it to your forehead. And that's basically it for my Rida costume. I'm really happy with the outcome and definitely planning on doing more challenging cosplays in the future. I've also done a photo shoot and you can see all of the pictures on my blog. The link for it will be in the description box. Make sure to like the video and subscribe to my channel for more. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you on my next video.